Last week I showed you how to install exposed framework on the OnePlus 3. And today I want to show you how to install an exposed module. Now exposed framework is just that, it's a framework that lets you install modules and it's the modules that make the changes and add the extra features to Android. I wanted to do this video for a couple of reasons. One is because installing an exposed module just isn't that straightforward, especially if you're new. And another reason is on the video that I did for installing the framework, I had a comment asking for some examples of good modules. So today, as an example, I'm going to show you how to install Gravity Box on the OnePlus 3. And Gravity Box is one of the most popular, if not the most popular, exposed module. So to do that, we're going to launch the exposed framework application. And as always, if you haven't done this already, I recommend booting into recovery mode and creating a Nandroid backup before we, you install any exposed module. Once you have the exposed framework application launched, go ahead and tap on the download button or option. Then we're going to tap on the magnifying glass that, at the top to search. And for this example, I'm going to show you how to install Gravity Box. So we have multiple different versions of Gravity Box. Since the OnePlus 3 is currently running Marshmallow, we're going to install the Marshmallow version of Gravity Box. Once you tap on the exposed module you want to install, you can check out the description. And then we can swipe over to the versions tab. Now I downloaded this earlier, but I didn't install it. So you're going to see a download button right there. Once it has downloaded, then it will pop up an app install, just like this. So go ahead and tap on the install button and instead of opening it we're going to tap the done button. The reason we do this is because we, now that we have downloaded and installed the module we need to activate it. To activate it we go back to the exposed framework main menu Then we're going to tap on the modules option and this is going to list all of the installed exposed modules that you have. But as you can see even though it's installed it's not activated. So you're going to need to tap on the box to activate it and then we're just going to reboot the OnePlus 3. this activation and reboot step is required for all exposed modules since installing and activating an exposed module is injecting code into the Android operating system you need to reboot the device in order for the changes to take effect
once we have rebooted I'm just going to show you that gravity box is activated now and now since we have installed it we're going to see a gravity box application icon in our app drawer once it has been activated and we have rebooted we can now launch it I'm going to allow a couple of, par of permissions and then we have this warning message right here so just tap OK got it and here are all the different features that come with gravity box I'm just gonna go through here and show you some of the features you should go ahead and pause the video so you can read all of this and see we have a double tap to sleep option for the lock screen this is our status bar section and up here we have a whole bunch of options in their own individual categories now the one plus three does ver run a pretty vanilla version of Android so most of these features should work then again it is not exactly vanilla Android like you see on the Nexus 6P in any other Nexus device so some of these features might not work just be aware of that all of these features are just embedded into this massive exposed framework or exposed module and installing other exposed modules are generally the same thing you're going to you're going to find the module in the download section you're going to download install activate then reboot sometimes an exposed module is not does not have an application with it to give you an example this expandable volume module that has been pulled from gravity box into its own separate exposed module you can see the open box is grayed out this means there is no application with it and it's just always active once you install it so sometimes these exposed modules come with an, a companion app and sometimes they don't and if you ever want to get rid of a module all you have to do is go to the modules section long press on a module you have on the list and then tap uninstall